Mobile game development often requires a whole set of unique tasks and challenges. Multiplayer and social features, preventing cheating, in-app purchases across various platforms, and continuously developing new content. We built upon our existing Match 3 demo to show how to integrate Unity gaming services in a typical mobile game's metagame. By metagame, we mean everything that exists outside of gameplay, like in a player hub, where you can add friends, customize your player profile, browse an in-game store, earn rewards, and use what you've earned to upgrade area items and progress in the game. There's definitely a lot here. If you've used Unity Gaming Services before, click the link below to our forum discussion post where you can download the project and follow the steps to get it working. If, however, you're completely new to mobile or live game development, this tutorial series is for you. We'll start from scratch with a brand new project and in each video we'll integrate a new service to what we're building. Let's walk through the series to give you an idea of everything we'll cover. We begin with player logins because we need an authenticated player to be able to save and load player data. We have separate videos for logging in through identity platforms like Facebook, Apple Game Center, and Google Play Games. Whichever you wish to implement, we'll come together again in player data, video number six, where we'll set up cloud code and use saving player usernames to introduce the concept of server-side validation. In player economy, we'll add some potions and gold to a starting player's inventory, and we'll establish architecture for new and returning players. From there, we'll cover virtual purchases with in-game currencies, like buying a new health potion with gold. The final two videos of the series cover in-app purchases, that is real money purchases, and then we'll use level play to implement rewarded ads. By the end of the series, you'll have something like a starter pack, a foundation that can be used in any game. And you'll be ready to check out the larger Gem Hunter project. All right, let's get started with a blank project in the next video on player logins. See you there.